So to give you an idea of how hotly contested it is, the, the difference between first and second place in this category is one point. Hi, my name is Marek Letoft. I'm the chief judge for the BMW Club Concourse. It's an event that we hold every year and it's basically a gathering of the finest, most original, cleanest BMWs in the country. This year we had 14 entries and there are four classes. There's show and shine where you just bring your car and you, you do a basic but nice and thorough clean. Then there is Delegance for cars which are not original but uh, have been restored or modified. Then there's a class called Data, which is focusing on originality. And then for people who've won those previous classes, there's the top class called Dernier, where the competition is really tough. Hi, my name's Sarah Lee Sadler. This is my car behind me, a 125i. This is my first car. I'm just freshly 18 in May and I entered it in show and shine today. It's a three litre six cylinder and we kind of a little bit of a last minute prep to pull it in but you know it's I try to keep it clean and we had my dad and my mom and all of our friends join in because we are quite a car family. We've got two of our other cars here today, my mom and my dad in daytime and uh, Anya but this is a show and shine car for the first time so it was interesting being the only girl and one of the younger ones but I think the bug has bitten me for concourse and I think this is what I'm going to start doing and especially with this car. This year we had a fantastic entrance, we had a great standard. Hi, my name is Prini Pele. I drive a 3 to 5 IS. It was previously a one owner car, I'm the second owner. We do this for the challenging, for our own gain. We do it to keep the car's values uh, above board, preserve it. Uh, we enjoy doing this and uh, I won the honor this year and I won best overall 3 to 5 IS as well. The honor class is the highest level that you can get to. It's a preserved car, it's unrestored. Uh, so it's all mileage, full service history, no paint work done on it, apart from a bit of cleaning. And yeah, we do it for the fun, enjoy. First place in show and shine is Rian with 94 points on his E36 325 Cabriolet. The next category is Delegance. That is a category for cars which are, are not necessarily 100% original. In first place in Delegance is Andre Alleman with his 325R Shadowline. Possibly one of the hottest uh, contended classes is then coming into a class called Data. Data focuses on originality. So to give you an idea of how hotly contested it is, the, the difference between first and second place in this category is one point. Our first place in Data goes to somebody who is uh, really passionate about BMWs, loves this car probably more than his uh, newly born child. It goes to Diresh in his E92 M3. So the final class in the concourse is known as Dornier. So we've got two divisions within Dornier. The first one is restored and the second one is preserved. So in Dornier, restored and that's Bilal Mir with his E3318 Coupe. And the winner of Dornier preserved this year, um, a well-deserved winner, is Prini Pile in his 325 AS Evo 2 with 133 points. It's also been a wonderful opportunity for us. Uh, I have written a book with my co-author, Johan Fenter, on the history of BMW in South Africa. It commemorates the 50 years that BMW has been in South Africa. It's 642 pages long, and it covers absolutely every element of it. It covers the special cars that were made here, the 745s, the 333s, and obviously the ISs, and everything else in between. It talks about the special people who, here, who were here who made that happen 
and it comes straight from the horse's mouth. We actually interviewed these people and it's been a fantastic journey of nearly two years of putting this together. It's in print, secure your copy of a limited edition of only 2,333 at vantagefineautomotiveart.co.za. Think of a car, any car, yes, cars.coza. Let's find what moves you.